George Houston and Jake Mintz outside Truist Park before Game 5 of the World Series, and Jake Mintz, an Atlanta sports team, has a 3-1 lead. You know what that means. I actually don't. So we're <laughs> going to walk around and we're going to ask these Braves fans about their city sports curse mm. and why they think this team might be the one to break. Can you explain the Atlanta sports curse to me? It's uh, it's alive, but tonight it ends. We go to the playoffs and we never like per, like go through and win. Like paint a picture for me. What does it consist of? What is in the curse? You know, in the curse, it's uh, high hopes. Yeah. And then they just get crushed. Oh yeah, it, it, it's it's uh, screwed us over for a couple years now. Can you explain that to me? I'm not from Atlanta. I don't know anything about the uh, Atlanta sports. I hear the word is curse. Can you kind of give me like the Wikipedia overview of what that means? I certainly can. Let me tell you something. I went to a place called Cochise College in Douglas, Arizona, my sophomore year of college. Okay. 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 Sure. Yeah. That was when the Falcons, the football team, blew. The Atlanta Falcons, the football team, blew the lead to the New England Patriots. And I'll never forget it. It was it was halftime, and my buddies were coming up to me. I was like, I'm a little worried about this. I'm a little worried about, you know, what's going on here. And I was like, no shot. We got it. Come the come after the third quarter, I was just like, oh, man, this is, this is killing me. They came up to me. They were like, New England, New England looks like they're going to win. I was like, no shot. No shot. And look at what there happened. There was a That's shot. the start of the curse. The Falcons, are they good or no? They're not good. What about the, the Hawks? Do they win ever? No trash. What about the Braves? Yes, they do. No Atlanta sports fan feels good with a 3-1 to one lead in series ever because of that last year. Ever. Yeah. Atlanta sports curse. Is that a thing? I, I don't know. Is that a real thing? No, it's, it's not a thing at all. No, it, it, it never will be a thing. Mostly after tonight, it won't be a thing. Well, I don't believe in oh, it. I don't believe in it. I don't believe in it. No, no. Why is that nonsense? No curse. Well, I don't know if I'd call it a curse, but we've been good for a long time. The Braves have been good for so many years. They got to the big show several times and only came out with one World Series. But that's changing now, man. It's a different year. I'm here with Michael, the five-year-old Braves fan. Michael, you look fantastic. Are you playing in the game tonight? You look like you're going to be playing tonight. Are you playing tonight? Yeah. Yeah. What position are you playing tonight? <laughs> right field. Right field. Right field. Which team is going to win the World Series? The Braves. The Braves. I mean, that's that's all you should really need to hear. Jimmy, where are you from, my friend? Puerto Rico. Jimmy, who's your favorite Brave? Eddie Rosario. Eddie. Damn right. Damn right, most hits ever in the postseason for a Puerto Rican-born player. He is amazing. All right, I'm here with Charles. Charles, uh, you told me you are a big Atlanta sports fan. Is that correct? That is correct. And you have the tattoo to prove it? Most definitely, man. You know, Braves, man. That hard Brave fan. Do you think this Braves team is going to get the job done? Are they going to win? Yes. They, why are they different? Why are they going to win? Because they're better. Do you think this year is different? Yes. What about this Braves team makes you think that the Atlanta sports curse could end tonight? Um, because we've um, gotten this far and we've really pushed through and um, yeah yeah do you feel good about this team breaking the curse I do I feel really good about this team the way they've been playing um, the just the chemistry's all been there That's I think I think we got it oh yeah I think it's about to be broken um, why 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 this year I I've never seen this much hype ever uh, I've never seen a team with this much hype I think we got people like Jack Peterson even though he's not hitting the best right now. He's got the hype. He's bringing it with the pearls. Everybody loves it. We need a hype guy like that, and I think it's got the team amped, which I think is going to change the whole narrative. Why is this team going to win the World Series? Their pitching has gone up a lot, and their fielding's improved, their hitting's improved, but I think they're going to win by the pitching. You think the pitching is going to get the job done? Jacob is going to perform a backflip in jeans. He's got real confidence. This will really convince me that the Braves are closing it out tonight. He's going to win. All right, let's see it, Jacob. All right, I'm a little nervous for you, Jacob. Oh, my goodness. He really did that. I think the Braves are going to win. What makes this team special? Why is this team different? You know, they've had so many division titles, only one World Series in 95, but why is this team different? Look at how much fun they're having. 
Ronald Acuna goes down. The team rallies. Everybody steps up. Everybody fills in. They're playing for each other. They're having a blast. Take a look around, man. Do you see that Atlanta spirit going on right now? I do. There's just something different about the energy going into this game that you're not going to find anywhere else. Atlanta is ready for it. We've been dying to have this moment, and we're going to make it happen. All right. We learned some stuff. I got to say, definitely more optimistic than I expected, but there's only one way to find out if this thing is real. Astros, pressure's on. Got to keep that curse up.